So we're currently in the worldwide celebration. We've just finished off part one with Vegito and Zamasu. Although not without complaints, I mean, there's a lot of complaints about Goku and Vegeta's performance being underwhelming. You've got Zamasu's name, which is being spammed all over Twitter to this day. And to be honest, part two, which was recently announced, was weird. I don't think there's any other word to describe it, weird. It's cool, but it's weird. Part 2 has gone with Future Gohan, a What If card, which I think is absolutely fantastic. And they've also got Sword of Hope Trunks. Now, two things here. Number one, Trunks, his kit is kind of eh, although we have to kind of see how it goes. And his animations are kind of... Yeah, I don't really need to talk about it. Twitter roasted him enough. I won't say anything. Suffice to say, Twitter was not happy. And then we've got Gohan, who is a very cool unit, very unexpected. His animations are great. And honestly, he's one of the best units in the game. The reaction to these units has been very mixed. A lot of people love Gohan, but a lot of people are also very upset about the fact that there is seemingly no Goku Black in this celebration, even though he was advertised. Now I mentioned that a lot of people are upset about Trunks in terms of his kit and animations. I honestly agree. They kind of just fumbled Trunks in what is technically his own celebration. I don't really understand where the devs are coming from doing this sort of thing. I don't know. Again, obviously I've yet to actually use the unit, so I'm withholding a lot of judgment here. But from first glance, I don't know, man. Me personally, I'm just gonna summon on Gohan and leave it at that. Something else I'd like to discuss is a comparison between last year and this year. I will say that last year was very more interesting. I think it was a lot more hyped out, to be honest. There was a lot more hype behind last year's celebration. This year has been very good so far. I mean, obviously for that Vegito, there was, I believe, 6 million views on one of Dolkan's official promo videos, which is, I think, the highest there's ever been on a Bandai Namco channel. But, I mean, apart from that, what other evidence do you have? Like, I'm just being real and just looking at Twitter. It just seems like there's a clear difference between the two different worldwide celebrations. I know a lot of people will probably prefer this one because of Vegito Blue, but I think, personally, we should probably wait to see what happens at the end of this celebration, whether they include anything in like a part 3 or something, remains to be seen. So far, it's been pretty good. I will give it that. Yeah, I'm definitely not a hater. I think so far, it's been pretty good. The only thing that I'm really upset about is just a lack of Goku Black and Trunks kind of being a fumble, I suppose you could say. On the matter of Goku and Vegeta, I feel like there's been a lot of exaggeration as to how supposedly bad they are. I don't think that's the case at all. I definitely think there could be some improvement, but to be honest, from the way I see it, I feel like it's not too bad. And my honest advice to anybody is don't jump on the Twitter bandwagon of hate. Actually use the unit first and then see what it's like, if you can, of course. And if you can't, there's always a private server you can use. But that's just what I think. Let me know in the comments below what you think and have a good one.